I might do another war. I mean, in fact, in fact, after that, I'm going to do Napoleon. So. Oh. <laughs> that, it, it seems that you do. You actually have a sort of schedule what you are going to do. Well, I'm actually. I, <laughs> to admit it, but I'm actually signed up to deliver Napoleon in 2021. Oh. <laughs> what, what will Napoleon say about that? <laughs> well, I did what Stormdown would have said about it. He would have approved. He said that a new biography of Napoleon needs to be written every six years. How he came up with the figure of six years, I have no idea. But anyway, it's an interesting comment. Uh, it's, 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 uh, it's a good point, and it sort of uh, goes back to what I said. There are some things that sort of exactly. has to be rewritten. Rewritten or re-examined for each, each new generation. Of yes, yes. Exactly. Um, but it, I can't believe that it's this, only this uh, force that drives you. It ought to be done. It must be something else. Uh, I, I asked you uh, just before here that what, you, what do you put your, yourself in your books? Where do, you find, where do we find you in your books? Um, well, I'm... Uh, I, uh, no, I think the only way you find me in my books is I just write the sort of book that I enjoy reading myself. Um, I mean, it's totally selfish, it's totally self-centred in a way, but I think that should be true of all writers. I don't think you can sort of write for somebody else. Um, you've just got to write for yourself. What, what, what about you? I think, I, I, think that's, I think that's a very good point to stop with. So. <laughs> <laughs> thank, thank you, Andrew.